you know um the um you know <laughs> the Sunday I named this artist here this is called um real ones by a process yeah and um I thought well I'm just knock- I'm knocking all my things around here still yeah but listen you know I was just like looking at you know that uh, so much in in, in in life today it's like everyone wants to deny a process man and uh, one of the things that you know that I do enjoy um I do think how would I be if I didn't go through process um how would I be if I um like was just chilling there and just like kind of like um like going yep I have what I've been destined and that's it man um when when I achieve what I've been destined to achieve and it's just like when you get there you won't be ready for it you know and I think too often that you know a lot of young artists I would say to you guys you know right you're in your early 20s in your late in late teens and you're looking at three four five years time to be the biggest artist in gospel I'm just like, yo, dude, let's be real here. It ain't gonna happen, you know, unless you have a hit. You know, that's great. But this is not even just applying for Christian artists, but just artistry in, in, in general, just just life in general. How on earth do you expect to be the best straight away? It's just like, you know, we got England football team now. They got a bunch of teenagers and youngsters. They're going, oh, this is great, this is great. But the reality show is they won't be at their best till later on in their career you know if they stay focused and if they stay on course you know i see some big time footballers when they're 18 19 20 22 23 of an awesome a tunica injury bam and you don't see him again you know um to see players like even cristiano ronaldo who's great when he's a kid you know I mean, he's a great player but like to see him excel 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 go better get better get better and better again that takes dedication and it takes effort to achieve the full potential that you have and i think christian right now is definitely a, full, a great example of that um but also there's a lot of great examples of people that didn't fulfill the potential because you know what still yeah they expected all to come to them you know and there's um in all walks of life there's, there's kind of like loads of um examples of that and i think that you know what guys all I can do is encourage you to like, you know, realize that whenever, you know, you start this media wise, I was just talking to um, a friend of mine, Gideon, and I said to him, I said, listen, guys, you know, a lot of people are just starting up little media things and starting up different things within the gospel because they love God, they love doing the music, they love doing their creativity, they want to do it for God and dedicate it and whatever. But but then six months down the line, a year line, two year two years down the line, they get discouraged because things are not working the way it should do. Guys, you know, I'm not singing my own trumpet here, but like, yo, I'm like going on to two decades on this, you know, and it's just like, you know, and I'm still scratching the surface, man, you know, so like, no way you're doing it first, man. If you're doing it for for, for, for success straight away, still, yeah, it, it, guys, you know, um, where it's not going to happen, it's extremely highly unlikely to happen in it and you know and yeah just extremely unlikely so the guys just set yourself up ready for that don't really get caught up on the hype and and think i'm gonna jump on this and be successful overnight still yeah so uh, what i would do as well anyone who does get success at, at this stage and i look back up the successes at events and whatever and i just enjoy the development which god has put me in place for me to be able to put on successful events now and the people that he's put around me um the experiences that i had it's like i kind of like almost know what's going to happen not, not because i'm great and fantastic just because of my experiences and because of my mistakes um and so when i still yeah and other people's mistakes that i've learned from as well you know so uh, you know if anything's a trade secret that's my trade secret anyway still yeah but listen guys this is a track called real ones by process still roger over and out ish <laughs> <laughs> 